coffee guys if you haven't made your tea or coffee yet go make yourself one before we start the flip we have here one of a pair of George Forrest over wine colors by Benjamin Smith who won the That's available on our eBay store guys. The midwinter porcelain. Have a look. What do we have here? James one silver gilt steeple cup London sixteen eleven makers mark F D probably for F Terry estimate thirty thousand to fifty thousand USD this one I think next Aunt Elizabeth one silver beaker London 1594 Maker's Mark Estimate 5000 to 8000 USD It's this one And a Commonwealth Silver 200 London 1658 Maker's Mark EP Estimate 4000 to 6000 It's that one Silver from the estate of Mary, Viscountess Rothermere, to be included in the sale. Okay, so that's a man buying Christie's of Park Avenue, New York. And we have here the comments for your April 1994. Volume 65, number 4. And in our front cover, these are the details. The first Duke and Duchess of Marlborough with their family, 1693, by Johan Klosterman, Blenheim Palace, Woodstock, Oxfordshire. Francisco Goya, this is Spanish for fighting. I love this issue. Look at her. She looks like Georgiana, Duchess of Devonshire. Let's flip through. We are in for a treat with this copy. It's mostly copper, so I'm happy. A large and 
Outstanding Scottish sampler in colored silks by Anne Deacon H9 Association. 
This is details of the founding of the 
fancy state dining room is now used by the family only once a year on Christmas Day. The marble door cases were commissioned from Grinling Gibbons. Surrounding them are Louis Laguerre's strong blue whale murals. He placed himself in the picture father. Next to Marcus Chaplin Dean Jones. Above is the great hall ceiling painted by Sir James Thornhill in seventeen sixteen. That picks the first tube of marble.
this is the witch's sabbath 